Colorado Springs welcomed the temporary home of Space Command with a lot of fanfare. Well, now the Springs has lost the space race to Alabama. Space Command moving to Alabama. The Trump administration announcing that move today. CBS Force Michael Abeda on the story this evening. Michael, just tough news for El Paso County. When will the command make the physical move? Well, the Air Force has a five-year commitment to Colorado Springs right now. And you know, Jim, the Air Force has a long history here in Colorado, whether that's at Aurora's Buckley Air Force Base or at one of the several installations down in the Springs. And Colorado Springs Mayor John Souther says he's going to do everything he can to make sure the Space Command never leaves. I am uh, deeply disappointed and very surprised. Colorado Springs Mayor John Southers not holding back his emotions has responded to reports that the new Space Command is moving to Alabama. Both Alabama and Colorado went through a selection process and Air Force sources told him they believed Colorado Springs was the clear front runner and that Huntsville was chosen over Colorado Springs by President Trump for reasons other than national security and what's best for the American people. If you're asking me would I attribute personal motives to the president, absolutely. Even though Colorado Springs and El Paso County are reliably Republican and Trump-supporting areas, Mayor Souther says he has it on good authority that President Trump is playing political favorites. The bottom line is there are significant political connections uh, between the president and uh, the congressional delegation in Alabama and what perhaps he hopes uh, uh, they may uh, be of assistance. And when asked if Alabama is just a better choice, the president and CEO of the Colorado Springs Chamber questions how anywhere could be better than the place that's already housing it. That can't be true. There are no Space Force assets in Huntsville. The mayor says he's spoken with the governor and Colorado senators, and they plan on asking the incoming Biden administration to overturn the decision. And these conversations about the inappropriateness of this decision will take place. Now, the Colorado Springs Council says that if they don't get the Space Force Command Center, that they'll miss out on $450 million a year. In the meantime, we asked the Air Force if President Trump did, in fact, override the recommendations to keep the command in Colorado. And they told us that that is, quote, not accurate. In Aurora, Michael Aveta, covering Colorado First.